Hello dear Taurus and welcome to your second half of August readings with me. If you are new to my channel, please do subscribe. Let's see what's in store for Taurus, Sun, Moon and Rising. The third week for you of August is full of divine protection. You are being protected if you have been um, suffering from any health issue. If you have been wondering how life is going to get better or not, if you have been struggling with some challenges, something regarding to your job, your relationship, okay, your health, your finances, then I see a divine protection upon you. The third week's energy is telling you, my dear Taurians, is that tread with wisdom, okay, walk ahead with wisdom. The mistakes that you have committed in the past, don't take those and walk on this path now, okay? Now is the time to remove extra baggage that is not required and walk wisely ahead, okay? You might feel, my dear Dorians, you might feel also there can be some aha moments when something gets revealed to you, when something is becomes known to you and you say, hey, I... I was so blind not to see it. I was really as if my mind had closed itself and I I didn't want to see anything. Yeah, and right now it's just like, you know, like somebody does like that and that uh, the spell or if you were hypnotized by something and just suddenly the reality strikes. Okay, the illusion is broken for some of the Taurians is what I see also. Okay, and I also see that whatever projects you're working on, uh, I see that they will be successful in the coming times is what I see. I also see my dear Taurians that the divine is telling you in the third week is that my dear Taurians, don't take any hasty decisions. Be very, very careful where you are investing your money who you are acquainting yourself with, where are you, you know, investing more energy. Now is the time to really do a, the reality check, I would say. Yeah, this is what uh, this energy is telling you. For Torian students also, be wise. Don't just blurt out anything in front of a lot of people so that they take a half of that information and pass it on to somebody and then that creates misunderstandings in people. If you have had a fallout with someone, my dear Torians, is that then I would tell you that in the third week is the time to... Use patience, love and compassion in order to patch up uh, with your near and dear ones is what I see. You have to be the one to extend. Don't shut yourself down into things, my dear Taurians. And you are protected. So you, I would like to tell you almost, my dear Taurians, in the third week of August, I would like to tell you to repeat it to yourself. Wherever you go, whatever you're doing, just inside of you say, I am protected, I am protected. You say that inside of you to, you know, make that uh, what we call the armor very, very strong, that armor of protection very, very strong uh, is what I can tell you, my dear Taurians. And then in the last week of August, I see that you are dealing with the feminine en energy. Now, this feminine energy is a very, very, it's a very, very loving energy, my uh, dear Taurians, this energy, it can be that of your beloved, it can be your girlfriend, your uh, sister, it can be your mother, it can be a new colleague, it can be um, a person at your, uh, you know, where you go, for example, uh, if you're working, or rather if you are unwell, then this person is in the form of a nurse also, is a, a medical practitioner, a specialist also. This lady is very loving, very giving, no hidden agendas at all. For some of the Torian gentlemen, you might uh, come across or you might communicate with this feminine energy in the last week of August. It can be somebody you you are at distance also, geographical distance from also, or it can be somebody very close to you also. And this person is helping you in some way, is what I see in some kind of, uh, some enlightenment is what she gets for you, is what I see, uh, my dear Torians, in the last week. For some of the Torians, you might get engaged 
uh, to a person or you might take your relationship to a new level with this feminine energy who is so motherly, so loving, so giving also. For Taurian students, it can be a new teacher, a new principal also, or it can be um, a person in your family who is helping you out, or it's a friend of yours, my dear Taurian students, who is helping you out at this point of time regarding a particular issue that you are dealing with in your life. For some of the Taurian, the feminine energy gets some kind of financial aid is what I see also. It can be your banker also or it can be your grandmother or it can be your mother. Uh, an elderly feminine uh, energy is what I see in the last week. Uh, all in all I see in the last week this energy is very much a feminine energy that is dominating this week of yours. So it can also be on a global level that there is something happening with the feminine energy that is also impacting you uh, is what I see my dear Taurians in the last week. All in all a very very positive energy. Now I would like to say that if some of you are devotees of a feminine goddess uh, then I would like to tell you to pray more to this feminine goddess energy in order to uh, get blessings, to seek blessings of protection, of love, of motherly love uh, from this feminine energy, this goddess feminine energy also uh, or I would say almost worship Mother Gaia, the Mother Earth, Mother Nature also uh, is what I can tell you my dear. Taurian. So then if you're wondering how to manifest, I have a special manifestation course for you. It's the stepwise guidance towards manifesting your dreams. I have been doing that and I got almost 98% of my manifestation list has been fulfilled. So come join in. It's a wonderful, wonderful course and many people have availed on it and are reaping its benefits. I invite you to enroll yourself to this course and you will find it on my website I'm going to give the link below in the description box so thank you for listening please do like share and comment and I shall see you next month until then take good care of yourself bye bye god bless bye